Hello, everybody. How's it going? Welcome to the show. The first one. The first one. Are you excited? Are you ready? Are you scared? Are you scared? Am I scared? Where am I? This is Coffee with Boba. I've worn a business suit and everything. And uh, we're going to have a really nice guest coming on here. You might know him, you might be aware of him. He drinks milk, he takes shits, and he cleans windows, or he used to. It's Raps. It's Raps, everybody. I don't, this, is, this feels so bizarre. Hello, thank you. I have a rep in my ass. I'm not going to show you that. Hi. Hi. Honored to be your first guest. Welcome to Hi. my show that you are now on. Mm -hmm. I feel underdressed. Really? Yeah. Did you not get the business note that you needed no. to wear business clothes? No, and also like minutes before going live, I realized I have a rep in the ass of my, my current... Yeah, I current did jeans. see it because it's... Yeah, she saw my boxers. Yeah, there's a hole in Raps' butt mm -hmm. that is unrelated my to... My ass is loose. His it can't be contained. Well, she said I do mad shits, and it's true. Yeah. I it's, did one right before coming in, that, but that's, that's why it's... That's the tube comes out of there. <laughs> do you know... It's like alien's mouth. What do, you think, what do you think you'll be experiencing today, Ravs? I don't know. I'm scared. Okay, I, well, I'm like imagining this is very Eric Andre, but I don't know. On the topic of being scared, I have this contract for you to sign. It's about liabilities and things like what? that. But it's no big deal. Skim it if you need to. Why is it so big, dude? No, it's an official document. Okay. All right, there's some stuff about here, but about injuries, potential death, property loss, um, something about vehicular traffic in case we go outside. Right. But could you please, uh, could you please sign here, can, please? Can I, can I read it first? Well, you can read it after. We don't have time to read it now. In, in def, uh, indemnify coffee with Bob, but uh, sure you know what this you sign here okay did you bring your parent or guardian uh yeah okay mm -hmm. who who is who's daff the, okay daff is your guardian yeah daff's my guardian uh can we get daff please we need a signature a daff signature please to uh legitimize this contract I need to write, oh, please write your name, I Ravs. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. on short notice, okay. we have... Nina, Nina, Nina works. We Nina have works. Uh, you're my parent slash guardian, Nina, and I need a signature on my... I am? Yeah, oh, you I are. Could you Thank please you. sign on Thank that you. second I'm, line? I feel like I should mm -hmm. read this. Oh, I've not been allowed to read it either. Mm -hmm. I have no idea. Okay, mm -hmm. sure. Where am I signing? Uh, just underneath me. Underneath? Mm -hmm. Okay. Does this make you my parent now? Yes. Okay, nice. Thank you, Dad. Make sure you're home mm -hmm. to see Okay, thank you so much. Excellent. Thanks, Dad. Yep. Excellent. Oh, thank you. Thank, thank you, Guardian. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, thank you very much pen. for signing that. Did you just throw away that legally binding contract? No, I put it in the storage. Oh, okay, that's fair. I need you to explain yourself because this next segment is called This You. This You. Uh oh. You have a you have stings made for Did this? That, Pierre. What? It popped up. What? Pierre, did that? It went boo. Did that sting have a watermark on it? Pierre, the no, assistant no, in the back, no, emote. No, no, Pierre, did that like sting have a watermark on nice. it? Still. I'll remove it. I'll remove it. Can we please get a sting without a watermark? There was a watermark. Did you have? That you sounded like the zoom was for me zooming in and out. Okay. It had a watermark. Blink and you miss it. Mm hmm. Ravs? That's your name. That, yeah, that says Ravs is this you. I think that would be me. That's you. So uh, I'm going to ask you some questions about some things that I found. I'm really scared for this. Yeah. Let's see your shoes. <laughs> those, are, those are some Yeezys that I bought and own. And, uh, you know, they're very comfortable shoes. However, Kanye West is a terrible human being. Mm. Mm -hmm. See, I, I got these to ask you about. Not yeah. because I wanted to put you on the spot yeah. about Kanye West. Yeah. But rather... Well, I will say, fuck you, Kanye West. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're, he's fuck watching. Fuck you, Kanye. We, we made sure that he was in the... Mm -hmm. uh, oh, here we got a Kanye. Mm -hmm. Boo. Even Carol hates him. Even Carol. Yeah. She likes everybody. Mm -hmm. 
So you're very fashionable, Rebs. I like my fashion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So what is your favorite clothing piece that you have right now? You don't have to be wearing it. Um, you do have trousers with a hole in them right now. <laughs> well, that's I say, right now. I say, I know you enjoy fashion to the guy with the hole in the um, I, I don't have it on me right now, but it's my ruffly jacket from mm -hmm. the werewolf stream. It's the... Look at that, though. Oh, my God. Look at that. Yeah. We've got thirteen dollars and nine cents, which I assume maybe is a conversion from pounds or something. I don't know. Ale Wolf, spin, spin, spin. This is great. Do I get a question or five? So we'll have that at the end. Mm -hmm. And then we've got another one came in almost at very close in time. Uh, thirteen dollars and nine cents from Softly Iris, who says, "Drink up, your pant wrecker." I believe. I farted. So, thank you very much. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm going to spin this, I think. Okay. I think I spin this. That's, I want to. That makes to. sense. You're sure you should spin the wheel. So, excuse me, there's a lot of paper back here. This is, what's your most hated thing on here, you think? Um, probably the out-of-date Gorp or whatever, or whatever Raw Dog is. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to have to put, we're going to have to censor the screen if we whatever. get that one. Whatever. We're gonna have the sense of the stream. What does that mean? This is for you, Ale Wolf. I like the evil lighting. <laughs> I think that says pickle juice. <laughs> you just moved that. No, I touched it and it was already on that one. Okay. I think it says pickle juice. I've drank so much pickle juice in my time. We've got a thank you, pickle juice, pickle juice, pickle juice. All right, please, um, one moment, one moment while I get this ready. Can we have a little bit more of volume on our audio in here? I would like Ravs to be able to hear this. Thank you very much. Ravs, could you start uh, taking a sip, please? Ale Wolf has done this, and I would like you to take a sip. You did sign the contract. Please take a sip. They're right in my face. What do you mean they're right in your face? It's delicious. People pay for this experience. Is it good? Delicious. Yeah? Want some? No. Oh. Make sure we hold on to that just in case we roll pickle juice again. We need a palate cleanser. We need a palate cleanser, and Softly Iris has supplied us with one. Can we cleanse Ravs' palate? Yes, we can! Raw dog, everyone! Raw dog! The fuck is raw dog? Raw dog! <laughs> Amazing! Eight hot dogs. It's the same fucking one from Jingle Jam. <laughs> We cannot confirm nor can we deny where this raw dog is. <laughs> <laughs> uh, don't make me bring it back. Do you want to smell? I don't need to. You don't need to, but do you want to? Okay. You've convinced me. It's not bad. Is it not? No. I don't know what you're upset about. No, it's like salty. This is, don't forget, you did sign this and so did your guardian. I really hate my dad right now. My Please. dad, how could you do this to me, dad? Did you hear our special effect that we had for this as well? Take a, get a listen, get a listen. That's just the noise it makes when I sip. It is. Yeah. How was that one? That one was not bad, actually. Is it just like water? I think because the, the pickle was so nasty. Yeah. That that one was actually quite pleasant. Yeah, it's not bad. <laughs> now. What? That is, that is not true. That is a doctored tweet. That's not. I would never say iron brew. What would you say then? I'd say iron brew. It's 4 a.m. though, and obviously you've just stolen. That, I'm not, uh, in 2011. Yeah. I, what age am I in 2011? I'm 18. <laughs> so at the prime age for crime. I think. So I was wondering earlier when you admitted to being British. This is doctored. This is AI generated. I will be getting my lawyers. Doesn't to say AI this generated show. mean that it would compile your tweets? And I would then make never convincing... say Iron Brew. 
that you you whoever your assistant is made a faux pas. This guy, mm -hmm. using his phone at 4 a.m. after stealing from a Tesco's, doesn't even realize that his phone would autocorrect. No, it would not. How would it not? I type iron. You type iron. I R N. Okay. Mm -hmm. Also, I the only time I've stolen anything in my life was a milky bar chew from a shop when I was seven and I realized it was in my pocket and I cried and I took it back and paid for it. How do you accidentally put a milky bar? Because I wanted to carry multiple things and I uh, put it in my pocket while I carried crisps to the clerk and then I paid. Then I walked out and I put my hand in my pocket and a milky bar chew there and I cried because I thought I was going to prison. This and then is... I went back and I paid for it and it was 15 pence and I still remember. This is just bad. This is bad. It's okay to steal from big corporations. I would never steal! It's okay to a steal from a big corporation. This is not but a real tweet. It's not okay if someone... to steal from a small mom and pop store. Tesco? Did you steal from Tesco? I would never. You just admitted Tesco. No, I, no, I just said. Where that... was this Milky Bar from? Oh, that was at a spa? What is that? This is like a little shop. A little shop. They're owned by, yeah. Asda. They're owned by Asda, Walmart. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, even though it is okay to steal from big corporations. Why would I also say fuck the British? I mean, I was 18, so maybe that makes a bit more you sense. You did also have. Yeah. You've hated the British for a long time. I mean, you're not wrong. They've done a lot of wrongs. They have done a lot of wrongs, even though I am from Britain. They've done a lot of wrongs. But mm -hmm. if you are. If you are saying and agreeing with me that crime is okay if you steal from a big corporation. Then why is that you, what I'm saying? Then why did you cry about doing it? Because I felt bad and I thought I'd go to prison. I am scared of being in trouble. <laughs> this could be anything. That was this you. Mm -hmm. We've got something else planned for you. Do we? Yes. The next thing we've got for you. I've heard you're an expert in your field. I don't think I'm good at anything. We know that you're really good at not having milk to the point where you could probably tell if something is dairy or dairy free. Okay. What do you think? What do you think I can tell the difference between something if it's dairy or not dairy? I'd be surprised. I could tell the difference. Yes. Don't know if I'd be good at that. Well, we're going to put that mm -hmm. theory to the test. This is expert in your field, and Ravs is going to tell us. Is that is this the name of the segment, expert in your field? Yes. Okay. And you are I'm an expert, expert in milk in your field. Yep. I wouldn't say I am. Bring in the milkman, please, milkman. <sighs> milkman. Milkman, everyone. This is absolutely like, satisfying to me, but it's right now the same thing. Milkman. Yeah. Like there's there's going to be one of them out there, right? One of these Let freaks in the audience. Okay, um, we- You know that it means I'm gonna like have a horrible shit later. Hold on, let me just, I need to check something really quick. Is it normal in a talk show for the host to leave? Um, is that like a regular thing that happens? Pure, right, is this did... my show now? Hi, welcome to Coffee with Ravs, your number one talk show on the Yoscast no, channel Wednesdays, 2 till 5 p.m. You wanna switch? To I'm your host Ravs, and today we're gonna have a very special guest on. Her name's Boba. Alright, so hold on, I've got to ask the studio a question. And you can donate £10 to make Boba drink some drinks or... I'm not drinking. ...questions at the end. Cut his mic. I've got... Cut it. Okay. Cut his mic. Okay, it's up here. For the... We did make sure that there is dairy free, right? They're whispering. Don't do that. They're whispering and they're being very ominous. Did we... Did we... If I die... If I die... No. Don't do that. I don't want to die. It's all there. Don't do that. Okay, okay. Can I just hear Pierre whisper it's all dairy? The milkman is here! It's from dairy. It's from dairy. It's from dairy. It's from dairy. We got it from the farm on dairy. From dairy, everyone. From dairy, everyone. Okay. Milkman, milkman, bring us some milk. Here he is. The resident milkman. This looks like no milkman I've ever seen before. This is our milkman precariously purchased. Uh -huh. And Rav, since you are an expert, you're going to tell us. Yeah. Here's your milk things. You will be telling us today which is dairy and which is dairy free. 
I think they all have dairy in them. No. He's just he's just drinking like a pint of milk. That's the milkman. It's in his name. Crickets. <laughs> That's not in the contract. <laughs> Can you please please be careful, sir, with the milk? We have prepared for you, you know today. What? I nearly did it as well. What? He had like the way the, I milk, know, it was... the way the milk was like dripping down his face, like I was gonna kiss him. We don't call him yeah. lips for nothing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Ravs, please yeah. tell us which of these options. Here's a one of them smells like actually, <laughs> like one of them actually smells like what the inside of your grand shoe would be like. Why? What are you doing smelling my grand's shoes? Well, you know, she's a very nice lady. We've been, uh, I've been <sighs> flying over. She does love her back, her bathrobes, her Yeah, back I've been flying over to Florida. You know, just me and her have been chilling. She lives in Texas. She came over to Florida. Okay. To retirement town. Amazing. This yeah. is scaring me how you're holding this. Yeah. Please perhaps balance it on your lap. Okay, I can do that. And then um, we've got for you a selection of cheeses. Mm-hmm. One is dairy and one is dairy free. Probably the one that smells really bad is the dairy free one. And then to wash it all down, milk to tell us if it is dairy or dairy free. Please consume. Oh, actually, one moment, please, while I wait for my sounds to recuperate. One moment. Okay, you may begin. That's butter. <laughs> Is it? That's just butter. So, it's a selection of butters. <laughs> and one is a dairy butter and one is a dairy free butter. It's very salty. <laughs> <laughs> it's like insanely salty. I'll hold your milk because I'm scared. Mm hmm Now tell us. Hold on. That's cheese. <laughs> The cheese and butter. I'm going to say that, that that one's butter and that one's cheese. Okay, and which one has dairy and which one does not? Doesn't butter have dairy in it? There's dairy-free butters. Is there? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to say... Thank you, I will take that. Thank Here, you. You may wash it down now. So you're saying that you believe the butter is dairy. Yeah. And the cheese, dairy-free. Okay. Tell us about the milk now. Hmm, fine vintage. Okay, from when? Hmm, probably about two weeks ago. Okay, age of the cow. Age of the cow. Gonna say the cow is like 34. Okay. Yeah. Color of the cow. White with black spots. Probably. It's not chocolate milk, so it must mm -hmm. not be a brown cow. Mm -hmm. Okay, please take a sip of this milk and tell us if it is dairy or dairy free. It's got dairy in it. Does it? Mm hmm Okay. We'll have to confirm that or we will not confirm it. Mm-hmm. I don't know how cows, how long they live for. I also... Don't, me either. I can't believe you ate butter like that. Okay. What? Here. You gave me the butter. Bring in the milkman again. We love that guy. I'm, I'm going to give the milkman his milk back. No, you can probably keep mm -hmm. that. You're so welcome. Earlier on, when... We were doing health and safety for this stream. I was stood with Pierre and Daff at Daff's desk and I farted. Did you? Yeah. That's what that was! Yeah, I did that. Yeah, I did that. That's my revenge. That's but a taste of what's to come. That's but a taste of what's to come. <laughs> this office will be punished for what they're doing to me today. Or Why do I have to drink more pickle juice, man? Look at this, that's nasty! Stephen! Oh, Stephen! Thank you. Please consume, it is the palate cleanser. Oh my god, the smell. <laughs> I don't like pickles. I don't like pickles. It can be the. It's just a little sippy sip. Oh, I will not forget. Excellent, thank you. Thank you. Mmm. He loves it. I love it. He loves it. 
He loves it. <laughs> Thank you very much, Milkman. I do believe we have one more object. I'm done. Milkman, we love this guy, the Milkman. That, <laughs> this could become. That was not in the contract, but I don't control these boys. TJ did just say contract, put that one on the, put that on the list. This could actually be jism. That is <laughs> This not. looks like the drainings of the fucking My Little Pony jar, man. That is <laughs> from the single teat cow out back. No, this is from someone's fucking figurine collection. So we had a hard time sourcing dairy free. So we did um, put an ad out on Craigslist or the equivalent of the UK Craigslist. And we said, hey, we are looking for a farmer to supply some dairy-free milk. Is this milk. skimmed milk? And so a farmer did <sighs> respond and he said he would meet us in a back alley, but we would have to wear a blindfold and we would have to suck it out of the cows ourselves. The cow was a single teat cow and we did have to spit it out in the glass after. So it is locally sourced and sourced locally. What was the name of the farmer? Little Timmy Blowjobs. <laughs> I've Little taken Timmy. that. I, I took that from somewhere, but I don't know where. Um, okay. I didn't get a name. He decided to remain anonymous. Okay. So, so dairy or dairy free rafts, please B consume. Both? Yeah. Test it. You gotta know. Is this one got dairy or is it dairy free? Oh, I missed the button. It's an after effect. Dairy. Okay. Is that a fucking... Is that a shot of ginger? I don't think so. Is it dairy free? <laughs> dairy or dairy free, everyone? Dairy free. dairy free. Dairy free. Dairy free? Dairy free. Dairy free? Dairy free. There you go, milkman. Did you say dairy free three more times? Dairy free, dairy free, dairy free. Dairy free. Dairy free. Dairy free. I don't know how much of an expert in your field you actually are. Uh, I think if we run the lab results, um, right. Okay, can we, behind the scenes, can we get the lab results run? Do, do you, why don't you have a noise effect for that? What, the, for the... Disgusting! Is that what you want? Why is there not like a... None were dairy. We don't... None? None, None were dairy. I downright don't believe you. This None shows a farce. None of them were dairy. That's weird. Let me check my notes. I do believe I said before the stream in our uh, production chat, I said, for expert in your field, we are going to have Rav's guess if something is dairy or dairy free. But the funny thing will be that all of them will be dairy free because I don't want his tummy to get upset. And then the next day when Sophie was sourcing the materials, she posted a screenshot of the shopping cart. And because Daph had accidentally invited you to that group chat. And so I didn't want you to see that it was going to all be dairy free. So mm -hmm. I deleted that message. So Sophie did get a bunch of dairy things. Uh, she's very nice, very kind and helped out a lot. Um, but I did have to tell her Oh, the joke is that all of them are dairy free. And she said, ah, yes, that makes sense. That's brilliant. So that's what we did. Are they so all dairy free? All of them were dairy free. As far as I'm aware, my that's what I planned on and what I hoped for. But my um, tummy's rumbling. I think your tummy is rumbling because of a placebo effect. I am pretty sure I just straight up drank <laughs> straight up milk. No. Like, the, the flavor profiles were there. Well, what I did say when I was sourcing these things is I said, make sure we don't get something like oat milk or soy because that is a very distinctive taste. Mm -hmm. So I said, make sure everything that we get mm -hmm. is extremely believable to be dairy. Okay, well, if we're going woke, then yeah, I guess like, all the dairy and cheese industries are very good now and the alternatives are much better yes. than animal products and you should use them. Now- How come your cars don't have anything written on them? They do though. I didn't see anything. You can't read that? Is it, it's empty. No, it's not. They don't say, her cards don't say anything. They do. They do. That's got stuff on it. Okay, all right. Spoilers. 
This one does say, don't forget, for $10 or more, you can spin the wheel. Please don't. Don't forget, minimum of two pounds, $2 donation, because we do need questions to ask Ravs at the end. So if there's anything that you would like to ask Ravs, please put in one of those donations and we can ask him stuff at the end, which we do have a very fun activity for him to do. Do we? He has to answer questions. We do. Okay. We've got lots of fun activities planned. Do we have, do we have that one fun activity? The yeah. creature? Oh. The, okay. I, I did request a specific creature to be brought in today. There better not be a fucking crab here. <laughs> if you guys bring in a live crab. Is this like um, that one lady where she really loves sloths so much that she anticipated a sloth being there and she started crying because she was <clears throat> so happy? I, that, would not, that would not be happy if you bring a crab in here. Ooh. I would not be. I, I, I don't know who's lied to you. Your assistant's lied to you. No. Failmore has done <laughs> a thousand bits for us to spin the wheel. I hate this wheel! Let's see what we get. It's time to spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. Spin the wheel. <laughs> it, I do believe it says pickle juice. I do believe it says pickle juice. Pickle boy! Can we get a round of applause, everyone, for Ravs being such a good sport? We asked Ravs, what's your favorite juice? And we thought he'd say something like cranberry, lemon, lime. Pineapple. Pineapple. But we all know that's not true. He requested pickle juice. Which you can't buy without oh, pickles in it. We've, we've emptied the pickles. But we out. have emptied the okay. pickles. <laughs> He's emptied the pickles out and noticed this fucking... I hope it's Gatorade instead so that you anticipate really bad but it is actually delicious, delicious. Why does this one smell more sauce? No, I don't think so. This smells like a vitamin C tablet. No, it's not. This smells... Are you... Are you am, am I... I, 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 I like my, my whatever it's called, vitamin C, and this smells like a vitamin C tablet. I am having to hover over this button for a long time, Ravs. Thank you. What is it? It's not pickle juice. What is it? It's a vitamin tablet. A vitamin tablet, everyone. It's a vitamin, tablet, tablet, it's a vitamin C tablet. Vitamin tablet. Not only did That's we nice. consider whether or not Ravs would shit himself if we gave him too much dairy so everything was dairy free, we also didn't want him walking away with some sort of uh, cold or ailment, so we have dosed him up with some vitamins. Mm -hmm. Vitamins! You couldn't get bagpipes, you could only get this. Okay. It's kind of meant to be like a bagpipe. Is that really offensive? That you got me this. Can you take this, please, Milkman? Also, Mr. Milkman, we will need some strong coffee when you have a moment. How does it work? You have to, uh... You have to, like, blow <laughs> after one milk. <laughs> you did a pretty good job of that. Thank you. Now as a reward, who would you say is your favorite creative person? Well, like... Maybe uh, someone who's well known for video games? Hideo Kojima. Hmm, interesting. It's mm -hmm. time for soon in short amount of time we will have a guest hideo kojima's here yes maybe no he's not no way of course he is i feel like he's here it's your special day and you we did scare you that you were going to possibly be touching a crab so we had to make sure that you were going to have a good time so if hideo kojima walks in here i'll freak out well you said that about the crab mm -hmm. that's true and here i am so do you have any questions that you think you would want to ask him uh 
maybe I'd have to gauge it when I see him. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, what do you think? If, it, if he was to come in here... Um, I'd ask a bit more about how he comes up with his ideas, his creative process. Okay. Um, I'd probably ask him how many scrapped projects he's had, because I'm curious to know what other games he's tried to cook up. Okay. Uh, you know, I'd just, just ask, you know, what, it's just, I don't know, I'd, I'd probably freak out a lot. You would, okay, so you'd be a little bit nervous. It's mm -hmm. okay. You don't have to be nervous. He's very nice. Mm -hmm. um, we didn't get a translator for today, but we did ask him questions ahead of time. Okay. For him to learn the responses in English. Right. Uh, so we did, we did think of like a mm -hmm. list of things that you might ask. Mm -hmm. And let's see, is he here? Okay. Now I'm gonna make sure I get this on my boba camera. Here he comes. What the fuck is this? <laughs> and it is the guy the Metal Gear music could be playing right now. This what is very fuck? scary because there's a lot of stuff on the ground. Look, it's the box, like from the game. Yeah, they do that. <laughs> He's here. I remember when Hedio Kujima. Okay. Yeah. Walk, him oh. Walk, Walk him around. Walk him around. All right, and the reveal. Wow, Kujima, you're very tall. He is so tall. <laughs> oh, Kojima san! He it even is. has his fox! He's got his shirt on! Hi, I'm, I'm, I'm oh my god, Kojima, it's, it's such a huge pleasure to meet you, sir. Oh my god! Lovely. I can't yeah. believe you came here! Lovely to meet you. So, Ravs? yes, Ravs, Kojima san. Feel free to have uh -huh. a seat, sir. I'm yeah. so happy that so you the flew. Is, I, 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 uh, all of my clothes shrank on the flight over. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you've had a growth spurt. Could you his know? glasses are... Fan? His yes, glasses. Mm -hmm. Where's my box? But, but you We've got it, it here. Can oh, no. You unequipped it? Here it is, uh -huh. sir. Thank you. Thank you. I need my box. Uh-huh. Um, yeah. I hear you're a big fan, Ravs. I, uh, a huge fan. Uh, uh, it's uh, it's blowing my mind that I'm sitting wow. here with you Would right you now. Would you like a photo? Yes, please. Should we could have I, a photo? Could I, take a photo? Yeah. someone get a photo of here. me, Kojima? Please. Let me see. Let me see. All right. Oh, hold on. What's that? Oh. The crab. He's afraid of crabs, but he touched a crab because he knew you'd be here. Amazing. Thank you. All right, Thank one you. more, one more. Oh my god. What's your, um, what's your favorite of my games? Oh, uh, you know, it's probably Metal Gear Solid 2. Maybe Metal Gear Solid 3, honestly. Mm -hmm. I couldn't remember that. I've played them so many times, like, honestly. What's your favorite like, bit about them? I, I like playing them. Mm hmm. I like the boxes. I like games with boxes in. You can put a man in a box. Mm -hmm. You can carry a box on your back. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So what? Like, what inspired you to get into boxes? Boxes. What about them? You can put a dick in a box. You can do that. Were you involved in that? Did you do that? I did that. Nice. How did you come up with that? I looked in the box and thought that you put the dick, dick in, in the it. Box, yeah. Were you trying to fuck the box, or did you just want to? Just trying to make in love to the box. Mm -hmm. I thought what you were going to ask like, him about his projects and stuff. What was it like with that working? I've on got that very project? limited time here. I, what was it like working on that project? It was very amazing. Mm -hmm. I, I personally, I'm a very big fan of Metal Gear Solid. I love it. What's know your, all about it. What was your favorite part working on the games? When the man goes in the box and is stealthy. That, that's what everyone knows me about. They go. Mm -hmm. Who is your favorite boss of design? The Sub Zero one. Sub Zero, yeah. Big, 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 big boss. No, that's the, Snake. That's the one. He's a big fan. This one. Yeah. He's a really he big fan. He mm -hmm. knows really all fan. of it mm -hmm. too. Um, uh, who was your favorite boss? I'm movie? more into movies now. I know you love movies. I love my movies. Can you tell us about the upcoming Death Stranding A24 movie? Can we get an exclusive scoop? Yes, exclusive scoop. Ravs will be in the new Death Stranding movie. This is it. This is what I've come here to announce. I've flown all the way in from Japan. I flew in last night, and, and this is it, Ravs. This is a Coffee with Boba exclusive. Mm -hmm. um, we didn't torture you for no reason. No, this is the happy part where you're in it, Ravs, and just say to the camera, I'm in it. I'm in the movie. Wait, shall we tell him he plays the baby in the pod? I'm in it. You're playing the baby. That's good. In the box. I'm going to be a baby. baby in a I'm box. playing Lou. The Lou, Lou baby. Lou baby. Lou Vega. That's right. That's a little bit of Monica in my life. In the box. <laughs>
Congratulations, Ross. Uh -huh. It's been an absolute pleasure. Thank you, Mr. Kojima san Thank you. Thank I look you, forward Kojima. to. I have to go tweet about Minecraft movie now. Okay, I look forward to it. Do you want another picture? Should we have another picture? Yeah, can we have another picture? Have another please? picture, please. Yeah. Okay. Biggest fan. My biggest fan. Okay. Amazing. Isn't this just so nice? Okay, he's just sniffing me. The man is sniffing me. <laughs> no, he was not. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you very much, okay. Kazim. Thank you, Mr. Kazim. Thank you, my box. It was so pleasant. It was honestly so pleasant to meet you. Thank you so much. <laughs> He's dragging mm -hmm. his microphone, but that's part of the experience. Bye. He stole the crap. <laughs> Goodbye. He's leaving Kajima in his box. <laughs> it says kilt. So. For our last thing to take us away, we have our Q&A from the audience. We've got an activity for you to do while you do this Q&A. Okay. Let me bring up the tab for the Q&A too. Any last minute questions, please get those in. Because we will be asking Ravs and he's clapping. All right. What have we got, lads? Today, Ravs, we would like for you, we've bought you this, and we will need you to make your own kilt while I ask you questions. Does I don't know how to do this. Yes, you do, look. What? <laughs> I've never sewn in my life. So here you go. You're going to sew yourself. There's so much fabric. We did measure you. <laughs> What the fuck? And then we got extra just in case. So here's your needle and thread. Okay. Now this is, so when you're, when you're using a needle, you want to put this on your finger so you don't poke yourself. So you put it on that little one. It does look like they go in those holes, but that's just a sort of, okay. it's a diversion. So when you're poking it through with this hand, just make sure you don't poke into your fingers. And you might want to maybe, you could get like a, find the end of this. Maybe do a rough estimate as to how much you will need. And then just sew those bits together maybe. And I you can... just sort of push the needle in and then pull it back out. And while you do that, make a toga, make a toga even. Teacher's right. So we've got some questions for you while you do this. Okay. Ale Wolf says, Ravs, are you happy boy? Uh, I would say that I'm fairly happy. No, this is the lowest point of my life. Sewing a kilt on my shoe. Mm -hmm. mm. This is... Can this we has do been a cocktail? Oh, no I, no, I love kilts. I love making kilts. Okay. Wait, no, I, I'm so bad at using a thimble. They, it's probably... Well, you do have larger hands. I think they might be for little old lady hands. Mm -hmm. Um, what do you think makes you the happiest then? What makes me happiest? Yeah. Um, hmm. I don't know. I think making people laugh. That's a good one. That's a nice one. Let's see. How many hard boiled eggs does Ravs think he could eat in one sitting in a life or death situation? Well, glad you asked. Bring in the knives and the hard boiled eggs. Um, I think like... Just kidding, we don't have knives or hard boiled eggs. I think I could eat like six hard boiled eggs. In life or death? Oh, life or death? Yeah, if someone was like holding a knife to you and was like, eat these eggs. Yeah. Or I will get rid of you. Nine. Okay. Nine hard boiled eggs. That sounds so horrible. Eggs. It does sound pretty bad. I don't know what I'm doing, I'm just sort of feeding Fred through here. Well, when you wear it afterwards, we'll uh -huh. see how well you did. Okay. Are you aware that lactate is a thing? You can eat them like gummies and have a milkshake worry-free. Buy some or don't if torturing your coworkers with farts is just your thing from J.R.R. Toshkin. Yes, I'm aware of that. Have you had lactate? I, I usually have them. Yeah. And I would have had them today if I knew. If you knew what? We didn't give you no dairy here. Well, you know, jury's out. I guess dairy's out. Du da dairy's out. Captain Ben says, can you say Klim 50 times? Clem, 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 
Clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem, clem. That was it. Clem. I think you can do it. Okay. Champ says, Ravs, what's it like being friends with known food criminal Boba? Keep in mind their years of transgressing basic food norms. Love you, Mom. Ravs hug. Um, you know, I I still remember the diet. Dorito consomme thing you did yes. or whatever. That was one of the worst things I've ever seen in my life. Am I... Okay, so perhaps if I'm a food criminal, I feel like... Didn't you, like, you have... also squash a sandwich with your foot? No, I, well, I had no other tools available and I am innovative. Feet sandwiches. It was in a plastic bag. You'd be eating those dogs. That's crazy. I did not do that. <laughs> Even though Donald Trump may have said that, I would never do that. Um, well, what were you going to say? What's my food crime? You drank all that nasty shit today. You made me! I didn't. I signed a contract. That's legally binding. Yeah, but you can say no. What, what am I going to do? <laughs> sue you? I can say no. All right, one more. We're drink. Costco guys. We've only got a few more minutes. Please don your kilt. I, I don't think I can. Please don it. The, the thread is still attached. Well, I, I broke it off. I'm putting it the thread like down. It'll be like a bonus. What do we hope it is? <clears throat> what the fuck, man? That's oh, a nice Pepsi to finish things up. Here, I'll wear my kit like this. Okay, here. This will do. He looks great. All right, milkman, one last drink. We need a Pepsi. To wrap things up, it has to be prepared by the... Thing. This pre-milk, this is a union mandated cup. Uh, yeah. But also I wonder... Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> I do not control the milkman. <laughs> what did he do? So soy sauce. <laughs> soy sauce? Oh my goodness. <laughs> How have you enjoyed your time on my show, Coffee with Boba? Have you had a good time? Would you do it again? Would you have said yes if you knew this was what it was? When you're expecting fizzy bubbly Pepsi and you drink soy sauce <laughs> and water. Is that what it was? Yeah. Not even Pepsi. It wasn't even Pepsi. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god i'm just a, listen i'm just the vessel for which the mm -hmm. studio and daf are getting to yeah express themselves holy fuck that sounds <laughs> if daf just poured it into the glass if daf just poured it into the i smell soy sauce <laughs> <laughs> oh you my know what? goodness <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. <laughs> All right. What do you have to say? You can promote yourself. Is there anything that you would like chat to check out for you? Hi, I'm Ravs. I'm going to be starring in the new Hideo Kojima movie, uh, Death Stranding, a 24 film coming out this year, next year, maybe a year after that. Uh, Hideo Kojima was here early. He confirmed that. Um, and also, um, fart. 